Hello Wolfpack, Captain Tiger Lily here, and we are back with more of Nexomon. Now in the last episode we made it to this desert -y city that uh, a bunch of the people from the Nexo Lord have all just like commandeered. It's kind of terrifying. Uh, but we're going to talk to all these people in this side of the town because I didn't do that in the last episode. We're going to do that now. See what's up with everybody. Our town used to be full of tall buildings and thick walls. But Overseer Jack has demolished it just to dig some treasure underneath. Dig up some treasure underneath. My nose is itchy again. As long as I don't have another nose blade, I don't want to deal with that. It's been really bad lately because it's been like back and forth between humid and super dry. So my sinuses are all kinds of messed up right now. It's fine. I came here all the way from Parham too. It's amazing how different this place is, don't you think? They say this town was quite a big deal back in the day. Now it's just some wasteland. Someone has to stop the next load before the same thing happens to Parham. I agree. That's what I'm trying to do. Okay. Um, we should probably go up the tower. Well, that was weird. Anyway. Ah! Oh my god! Are you okay? Not really! You idiot! Why'd you scare me like that? I'm not intentional, man! What? You're looking for Alvin? Well, that's me, bud! Repair something? Look, kid, I'm too busy to fix your toaster. Both the Nexo Lord and Overseer Jack want us to complete the digging ASAP. No time to rest. Listen, dude. Fix Atlas. What do you mean it's not a toaster? What is it then? A microwave? What in the world is that thing? Hmm. Never seen a toaster this advanced. Just kidding, pal. I recognize a clever design when I see one. Gotta admit now. This robot really piqued my interest. Hmm. Well, I'll need my tool box for this, but it's at the digging site. I suppose you can come with me to pick it up. If anybody asks, just tell them you're my assistant, alright? Cool. Let's do it. Alrighty then. Follow me whenever you're ready, pal. Okie dokie. I'm gonna go up this way and talk to this dude. Oh, I can't wait to be done with these stupid dig sites. What are we supposed to find down there anyway? Well, I know what you're supposed to find. But it's not good. Just so you know. Overseer Jack has promised to restore our city after the excavation is complete. That's the only thing keeping us from running away. We can only hope. Most of our people live in the mines now. There are camps scattered all around the dig site. I wonder if we should just make our whole town underground one day. That'd be kind of cool, underground city. Hmm. Found lava at the bottom of the dig site. Fire types. That shouldn't be such a huge problem, I think. I mean, I friggin' hope not. What's this say? Mining personnel only. Okay, cool. So, I probably have to go in this house? No, but it is just a house. Hmm. You looking for someone? Everybody's down there in the mines digging for Overseer Jack. Well, that's where I'm gonna be headed then. Not trying to steal your muns, but you are leaving shit everywhere. Just, um, maybe don't do that? You know, if you don't want people coming in and stealing your shit. What about these guys? Back to work! Go back to the mines now! Okay. Rude! I don't even work here! Oh, no. Oh, this is bad! Gentlemen. Today is the day you will witness the product of all your efforts. The almighty Grunda lies under our feet, 
And today, you will have the honor of awakening his unstoppable power. Grunda's coming will make history, and you shall be a part of it. What's the matter, Fenrir? That kid and the other fools. They're on their way here. Did Merida not sink their ship? I can still sense them nearby. Merida can't get anything right. Hmm. Then I trust you can shut them down before reaching Grunda's chamber? I will. Not if I can help it. Let no more be said, then. We will make our way to your sibling's chamber now. I'm guessing the dude with the goggles is over here, Jack? Yeah. <clears throat> Heard the big boss. As your overseer, I want all of you to put in every single ounce of effort you got into this final day. Now, let's go dig up this big guy they call Grunda. Then and only then will we be finally free from this day of digging site. Oh, excuse me. Oh, I don't know where that came from. I'm not tired at all. Now, to work! Great. There he is. Oh, there you are. I don't like that they've got collars on. It's very reminiscent of, like, Slaver's Bay in Game of Thrones, and I hate that so much. Picked a bad day to come here, don't you think? The next Lord and the Overseer Jack are both here. Did you know they're about to break into Grunda's chamber? I don't really see the point in reviving that big pile of bones, but it's the next old lord's orders. Sure you want me to fix your robot? We can always do that some other day. No, it's gotta be today, man. I need Atlas. Alright, alright. Just keep your mouth shut and don't touch anything in there. Everybody's busy working extra hard, so don't think they will notice you. Okay. I feel like there was a path out there. Impressive, isn't it? Grunda of the Earth was one of the seven most po powerful generals. Was one of the seven powerful generals that fought mankind thousands of years ago. After the legendary hero Ulzar defeated Grunda, humans tried to bury him in this massive prison. They were afraid Grunda would come back to life. See. And now, the next lord himself is trying to do exactly that. Nobody really knows why, but we got no choice but to obey our overseer. Anyway, let's look for my toolbox now. Can't be that far away. Watch out for wild Nexomon around here. For some reason, Nexomon near the chamber are really hostile. Okay. Apparently, we're gonna need that. in the wall? Kinda like it. Ooh, death worm. Well, I wanna do one of, one of, one of these. Oh, we gonna catch it. How actually dare you? Like, how actually dare you? You better go in that trap. You better frickin' do it. Okay. Uh, this fainting of spurk nonsense. Not today. Okay. We have a death worm. Oh joy. That's what I want in my life. A death worm. We're gonna do one of these. And we're gonna do one of those. And I'm gonna give that to spurk. I don't know if that's the best, but we're gonna go up here. I feel like something should have been over there. Oh well. It's fine. Oh, Prismates, I've got one of you. But I would... What am I doing? What did a team? I want, I want, I want... Abadog. Ooh, that was good. That almost was a one-hit KO. Which 
which would have been amazing. Nice. That would have been a one-hit KO. Woohoo! Enterfox and Prismaze are about to get a level. I really don't want to keep using super potions, but I also really don't want to go back to the center. <gasps> Did I not heal Artivore? Is there not a center here? Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. That's bad. Oh, we're gonna have to do some, like, fight and fight. <gasps> Imperaby. Bad. Uh. Let's go Prismazer. Okay. Oh yeah, we didn't get to see this one yet. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, Prismazer, come on, man. You were so close. Okay, um, I'm just gonna use regular little potions on Spurk and on Artivore. Because they were... Spark has such a low HP. Oh, we're almost done. Almost done. Okay, I just wanted to be healed up just in case, because that kind of looked like a fight. Took an entire year to clear this massive place. What lies at the end? Bad things. Bad things lie at the end. I'm almost out of Gatorade. And I only have one more. I'm saving it for work tomorrow. So I go shopping. Okay. This time I want to try to catch Imperabi. I wanted to see that move really bad though, so I'm gonna do that one. Shit. Okay, never mind. And we got a level for Spurk, Enterfox, and Prismacer. Okie dokie. Is what it is, I suppose. <laughs> Whatever. Item? No. Pump. Did you hear? They found a chamber full of lava. That's bad, right? This is getting ridiculous. The next alert is crazy. Did you not already know that? Like. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. Okay, okay, okay. It's a rare. Okay, perfect. Oh, I want this kitty cat so bad. I do not know who I would switch it for, but I want the kitty. Come on, go in the trap, please. Please, 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 no. No. I don't want to hit it again, because I don't want to knock it out. Oh, okay, never mind. <gasps> no, Spark. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, Enter Fox. <gasps> Perfect, okay. You're gonna scratch, that's fine, that's fine. Come on. I don't wanna use the golden. No, I don't have to. We got the Pharaoh Kitty! I'm so happy. I don't think you understand how happy I am. I'm sending it to storage for now because I haven't decided if I want to take one of my other ones off the team. I really don't. I really would like to have one of each type of those on the team because that, like, normal type doesn't really have effectiveness against anything. So, I don't know. Revive Spurk. I'm gonna use some super potions. One on Spurk. And one on Enterfox. Okay. That's fine. There's an item. Alright, let's see now. Hmm. That's not a toolbox, that's a bag. Hmm, the damage is nothing serious. This is a well-designed robot. 
obviously Ellie made it. Him. Some tweaks here and here. This should do the trick, I think. Please don't eat me! That kid instead! Atlas? Oh. Hello there. This is a little uncomfortable. Where are we? Excuse me, what? Wow, what was that? They must be breaking into Grunda's chamber. What? Listen up, buddy. You have to leave this place immediately. I must go help the other miners break into the chamber. Jack will go nuts if he realizes I'm slacking around. I'll see you later, alright? I can't do that. So this place is... So this is the place Grunda's buried in, huh? Where are the others? Mm, about that. I see. I really need to find them. This isn't good. The Nexolord must be about to resurrect Grunda. We have no choice. We must go and stop the Nexolord ourselves. Yeah, I don't like it either. There's no other way. If he revives Grunda, there will be five champions to worry about. If this experiment works, the Nexolord might decide to revive Omnicron next. I could sense a tremendous energy signature deep within the mines. It's now or never. Does it have to be? I don't want it to be. I'm not ready. Okay. Obviously, I can't go in the water. Oh, Draclone. Don't like that. But it's fine. Abadogs get close to a level. Like that. Like that a lot. Here we go. What the heck are you? <laughs> Just... what now? Um... <laughs> what is this wish fish thing? I like it. But what is it? <laughs> I just... I don't know what this thing is! What the heck? Slippery. Like, I don't... I don't understand what it is. Okay, while it's still bound, I'll try to catch it one more time. See what happens. There we go. You're not replacing Spurk. But it was kind of cute. It was weird. I can't do this anymore. I must run away. I don't care if Overseer Jack finds out. Then run, man. What's she waiting around for? There's a hole in the ground. There's a hole in the bottom of the sea. <laughs> There's a hole in the bottom of the sea. <laughs> I don't like that there's a hole in the bottom of the sea. Uh, what's going on with that guy? Like, that didn't look good. Did you just... Oh, hell no! Rude. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. We're almost there. Almost done. I feel horrible for all these people that are stuck serving the Nexo Lord. Like, that's awful. Organita. Good. Um, I'm gonna go with that. That's why. Oh, Abadog, you're so close. I want the Abadog level. Ah, ship. For the last time, get out of the digging site! No! What the hell is your problem? This is my dream! I'm not leaving! You have got to be kidding me. Oh my god. Another kid? What the hell's going on here? I swore and he didn't swear. Oops. Get out of the digging site! I've got no time to deal with you. Someone! Someone come over here now! Yes, Overseer Jack, sir. Make yourself useful and kick these children out of my digging site! I don't want anyone near Grunda's chamber, understood? Yes, sir. I gave him a robot voice at first and I realized he's an actual person he's wearing a helmet. <laughs> Oopsies! Because you can see, like, his actual arms underneath. And his actual body proportions with clothes on, so... My bad. Okay, um... This is a good one for this. Because I can do one of those deals. Got him. Okay, he's got two more? Yeah. Faramoth. No, that's not great. We'll be good against that. Um, fire or electric? I'm gonna go for fire this time. I would like to use a fire type. I would like to use a dog. Yes. Oh, beautiful Abadog. Beautiful. And I don't have to switch. Dog versus cat. Dog gonna win. <gasps> no! Used a weak one. And you confuzzled it! Hells yes, Abadog. And you got the level! That's what I was waiting for! Means I don't have to heal him. <laughs> what? Wait a second. It's you! Oh my god! This guy! I must warn the next alert immediately! No, no you don't. <gasps> He's back! Remus! It appears we are rejoined by fate. Hello again, my friend. Hi, Bear Man. Indeed, the Nexalorn will soon break into the Almighty Grunda's chamber. This is our chance to defeat him now and forever. I feel like we're gonna fail. What are you doing here, Dina? I'm an explorer. I can help. I can't help it. No reputable explorer would ever turn on the chance to see Grunda himself. You do realize this is literally the worst time to come to this place, right? We don't have time to take this girl back to safety. Maybe she should come with us and meet the next Lord. What? Really? Time is of essence. We can't stay here any longer. I'll come with you. Overseer Hilda says you guys are unstoppable, so I have nothing to fear. She should say something else. Let's go then. There's a, there's still a long way to Grunda's chamber and the next award. Oh joy! Can I go that way? I cannot. 
More doors. I hope I got enough healies. beautiful puppy. Okay. I need another super potion for spark. That'll do for now. I'm trying not to use all the heals before we get there. I just... I don't want anybody to faint. I mean, to be fair, fainting is probably easier right now, but still, like, I don't want to deal with the possibility that it's gonna go real bad. Powerful Nexomon is buried deep down in these ruins. The Nexo Lord will restore his power. What will happen then? I don't know. Angelique! Um. Fire electric. Uh, but if I want to catch it, it's not good against me either, so. Let's go with, uh, let's go with one of these. Okay, that wasn't terrible. That was not terrible. I don't like that. Oh, I don't like that. Okay, I'm gonna switch only because I don't want Spurk to faint. Like, I don't want that. Okay, um... So not one of those two. <laughs> let's go with... Let's go with the Draclon. Let's do that. He's got a decent... He's got decent health that we can handle that with. There we go. Some bitches. There we go. That's what I wanted. Bound. You done got wrapped up in Draclone's tail. What'd you go do that for? You gonna go in the trap? Hmm? She did. She did go in the trap. I did it. Send to the storage. Shine kill. Okay. I need a heal do for Spurk. And a heal do for a Draclone. Okay. Moving on. Our town was destroyed for this. These dumb ruins lying under our feet. Better be worth it. I would hope so too, after all of the crap that they have done. Excuse me, a what? Oh, Abadoc. You beautiful puppy. Draclone leveled! Ultimate win skill. Yes! I've been waiting on that one! <laughs> I've been waiting on the ultimate skill for Draclone for a while. Yes. Please. Okay, I want to take... I want to take that one out. What's that? Refreshing Breeze that heals next to mine. Uh, no. Yes. What's that one? See, I didn't want one of those. Some of the earlier ones are fine, but I don't like that one. Uh, I want to put Fox out front. No, I don't. I'm not going to release it. Jesus. Uh, actually, if we're down here, the most that we've come across are air, a couple electrics, and some ground. I don't know. I guess Spurk is fine. I'm gonna need to heal Abadog though, cause my goodness. That was a bad. I'm gonna use some of these smaller potions. There, that's not bad. That'll do. 
let's go through the next spot. Ivan! I love his theme song. Well, 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 look who, deci who finally decided to come over. And here I thought I'd have to fight the next lord myself. He's got some biceps, man. I mean, to be fair, so does Remus, but like, Ivan's like, jacked. <laughs> as unlikely as it seemed. You know, I just realized, Remus is so very much like, blue with the blue hair <laughs> and the beard. He's got a very Poseidon-esque look right now. But when you add the bear helmet, all I can think is Jason Momoa. Like, scar over the eye, through the eyebrow, huge bushy beard, outdoorsy man look, so Jason Momoa. Anyway, as unlikely as it seems, Arqua of the Oceans failed to sink the ship with all of us. Guess the water champion isn't as mighty as she seems. She can't even play volleyball. The miners use a small camp to rest. If you need any healing or supplies, now's the moment to get them. Oh, thank God. Grendis chamber is very close, as well as the Nexo Lord. Hey, where is that burglar, Willie? He's probably on his way back to the hideout. That coward. After I'm done with the Nexo Lord, he's next. Let's just get ready to fight the Nexo Lord and the Overseer now. That's the plan. So, I would like that. Elixir. A reviver. And devotion. Please heal this. Do you need any healing? I do. I really do. Thanks. What is this thing? Okay, I'm gonna talk to all these guys first. I can feel the heat coming from the lava chamber. Nexomon are also really hostile down there. Great. What's a kid doing here? Get out now. Nexalor is down there with Overseer Jack. You can tell everyone is nervous. So the Almighty Grunda lies somewhere around this area. There's no way we can lift up that monster. Ah, uh, don't. <laughs> Nothing looks good. You evacuate as soon as we're done. Yeah, no shit. So, it said that I could buy things, but like, how? I mean, unless I have to go back. I don't want to do that. I really don't want to do that. But, we're going to jump into that in the next episode. So, um, I don't want to jump into it right away just because I feel like it's going to be a huge fight and then we're going to move on to some new big area. So, I'm very, very excited to see what this, what Grunda is going to look like. I have not, I have purposely not gone through and looked at any of the, de of the designs for characters past what I've already played because I don't want spoilers. This game is so fun and I do not want to spoil anything for myself. So... I am very, very excited to see what Grunda looks like, and I feel like we're going to fail at stopping them from resurrecting Grunda, but we're still going to beat Grunda, but we're going to fail to the Nexo Lord, and then he's going to go try to revive the other two and wake up Omnicron. So, we'll see. Um, I have a feeling that's where the story is headed, because it doesn't feel like it's even remotely close to being, like, end game, you know? So, we shall see. Anyway. If you guys liked this video, hit the like button down below, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button to join the wolf pack, and click the notification bell, that way you guys get notified when new videos go live. I will leave the full playlist for Nexomon right below me here on the screen, if you guys want to check out everything that's happened so far. And I will leave the full playlist for LEGO Lord of the Rings on the opposite side of the screen, if you guys want to watch everything that's happened over there. I'm very much enjoying the replay, and being able to put in, like, bits and pieces from the movie that I remember that are like either done similarly or the same in the game so much fun and knowing all those like little random trivia things about movies and TV shows and how they're made it just makes me so happy anyway um, 
if you guys would like to support the channel and get yourselves something uh, handmade by yours truly, uh, you can check out my crochet page down below. I will leave the link in the description. I have a few things on there. I do take requests. However, I do struggle with plushies, even though they're not, I don't know if they're really considered plushies. I call them cozies because they're not really plushies, but they're not really like stuffy animals. Like it, it's weird. Anyway, I call them cozies. I have two new patterns that I want to try. One is a little cuddly cactus and one is a little bumblebee. So I will let you guys know how those turn out probably in a captain's log video. So if the, if they turn out really good, they're going to go up on the critter shelf up there with those. The critter shelf may be changing because I have had a bunch of new books that I ordered and I don't have room for anything anymore. I need more bookshelves. <laughs> the ever-growing problem of people who love to read is I need more bookshelves. So anyway, it's fine. Not a big deal. So that being said, this is Captain Tiger Lily and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!